For the Otomo Bulldogs, Pape Kua is known for using his legs in soccer. But five games into the football season, the senior is gaining recognition for his hands. From day one, I love playing, playing receiver. Uh, I used to play with my cousin all the time, and uh, I realized that I could catch the ball really well and jump and outrun people all the time. This is only his second year of varsity football, and it all started when his coach noticed him. He was in my lifting class. You know, I saw him running around a little bit, and he's a strong kid, athletic. So I was like, hey, you ever played football? He's like, no, coach, I haven't. I was like, well, you need to. <laughs> and I'm sure I'm glad he, he decided to. But his coach was not the only inspiration to play. I got the motivation from my, my cousin that passed away. He was, he, was, he was really close to me. His cousin Emmanuel was a rising football star in Minnesota when a friend accidentally shot him six years ago. That friend thought the gun was unloaded. He shoot the ball right in the house, in my sister's house. Nobody believed that. Along with his mother, Leah Guayacrua, and his three siblings used to live in St. Paul, Minnesota, then found themselves in Muscatine, and now Atoma, where Crua plans to graduate from. Guaya is originally from the Ivory Coast, and thinking back to all that her family has been through, she is proud. <laughs> the happiness is full in my heart. The happiness is fought in my heart right now. I'm rejoicing. And so is Kru. I'm really proud of being a Bulldog, actually. I really love it. I like all these guys that I play with, you know. Without them, I don't know if I would have been in the situation right now. Kru plans to play soccer in the spring, but hopes to get a scholarship in football. Darius Joshua, KTVO Sports.